Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be another hair dyeing video. Obviously, I'm going to use the semi-permanent Sienna Brown 104 by Adore. Um, you know, I was just getting tired of this weird colors I have with my hair now. And I just want everything to be just cohesive. Just look at least close to the same tone. Um, partially, this is like a hair wash video slash dye video. Um, before I wash my hair or dye my hair, any water towards my hair, I always want to just, you know, shuffle it around, brush it out, um, to get any lint out. So you don't want to wet your hair without, I mean, with lint on it, because then it'll be embedded in your hair. I really wish I knew this information when I first started my locks, because there is no telling what's deep in these things today. But, um, yeah, so I'm just using, honestly, my son's brush to brush my locks. Um, yeah, a lot of stuff flying around too. Um, I just, you know, part it slightly, whatever you can say. Um, just trying to get every brush locked. I mean, every brush locked. <laughs> every lock brushed and attention to. And then, yeah, that's about it. After this, I then I'm going to spray my hair with some apple cider vinegar. Um, it's like watered down in a spray bottle. I also have oils in it too. So then I do that, let my hair soak for a while, just so I can like not have a full ACV rinse, but just get like a real deep clean. Um, nothing really special. That's just now my way of going about washing my hair. Um, so yeah, thank you for tuning in. Please subscribe, like this video. If you're new, um, just let me know what brought you this way. If you're a returning subscriber, uh, yeah, it's another hair dye video. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm not even, I'm not proud of it. I'm not proud. Okay, maybe I am. I need to change, guys. I said I wasn't going to dye my hair again, and I am. I know. I know. I'll do better. I'll do better. I swear. But, you know, back to the video. <laughs> Just get in there, you know, use your fingertips. Get any, you know, stuff deep in there. Try to get it out. And Because I've been working out. I've been sweating a lot and I just know my hair is pretty dirty and I don't wash it as often as I should now that I'm working out so yeah all right <laughs> so I'm gonna leave this on my head for about five minutes um after that I'm going to take a shower wash my hair I am going to be using the old good old clarifying cheap shampoo from the dollar store obviously I have used this plenty of times um I'm also going to go in with um, this anti-residue shampoo. It's been all over YouTube for people with locks and stuff like that. I've had this for a very long time. I rarely use it, but um, just because I've been working out, I want to like, you know, clean my hair pretty good. Um, also, I'm going to then shampoo my hair with um, some Celsius Blue. I haven't had any more dandruff problems since the last time I washed my hair with this. But, like, my hair was, like, super scabby and dandruffy for the first time, like, ever. It was, like, bad. I used this once and it hasn't been a problem since. But that was about almost a month ago. I washed my hair, honestly, like, once to twice a month. Now I'm working out. I need to wash it more because, yeah, my hair gets gross. Especially if I forget to bring my hair tie. Um, so this is, I only have one of these because I wasn't sure what color I was going to end up choosing. And today just felt like the day that I was going to do it. So this is why it's happening. It's a Sienna, Sienna, Sienna Brown Adora 105, semi-permanent. Um, if I didn't do this in the voiceover beforehand, I pretty much just want like the color of my hair to be close to the same color throughout. Um, I pretty much stripped most of that red out of my hair using um, the ACV rinse stripped a lot. And then I just, every time I wash my hair, I spray it with um, my watered down apple cider vinegar and oils and stuff and that strips out the color. It was just getting like, it was too bright. No matter what I did, it just felt like it was too bright for me, but it was very nice color, so yeah if you guys came from that video and you're looking at this like 
I stripped the color out of my hair using apple cider vinegar. Um, I'm pretty sure it definitely would have stayed a lot longer. The times I did wash it without it, like not much color came out at all. Um, so this is the color I end up with um, a year later, a year. I dyed my hair in 2020 in June. So it's um, November, 2021. So yeah, um, that's the color I have now. This is what I'm just trying to make it even throughout. I'm just gonna use the whole bottle. Um, I'm pretty sure I need more than one, but again, this wasn't really a full commitment until this moment. So um, yeah, this is gonna stay on my head for five minutes. I'm gonna do all this washing, come back, and then I'm just gonna throw the dye on my hair. I said it needs to be damp. I've tested it out. I put it like on one a while ago and I like the color, so. Shampoo and tire will dry your hair. Use protective cream, run hairline, whatever. Um, apply from one blah, blah blah from the scalp. Cover with the plastic cap, process heat up to 15 minutes. Um, I'm not, I don't have anything with heat, so I'm gonna leave it on for quite some time. Um, yeah, again, it's semi permanent, fully permanent. So I'm not expecting it to be like super powerful, super wonderful, or last long. I just want it to help out the colors a bit. So yeah, bye. All right, so I just finished washing my hair. I only used the clarifying shampoo and the Selsun Blue. Um, I don't really condition my hair. I didn't feel like using the anti dandruff I mean, anti residue one. I just felt like three different shampoos was just enough because it takes forever to like rinse my hair, like with locks. Like you gotta just keep going and going and going and going with the rinsing, just hoping you got all the shampoos out. Um, so, so here's my hair now. I ended up putting the same shirt back on because I mean I just put it on to even start this video in the first place because yeah and um, I won't mind if I get any of the color on it um, I always just like a good wash because like my hair feels lighter it feels less dry it just feels alive again because my, my hair was dry as hell <laughs> but um so what do I need? Oh, I have my dye, of course. And I have some gloves, I got them from Walmart. I really don't have a method to this. I think I'm just gonna put it in my hand and put it on my hair. Um, oh, I need hair ties. Um, they're wet, but um, <clears throat> like when I wash my hair, I wash it in sections, just so that I can, you know, get the scalp good, get everything good. and rinse it out just as good as well so um this is my hair now so i kind of just want all these colors to look kind of cohesive you know got like some blondish looking brown and i don't know we will see what it ends up looking like all right i got a bowl Regular little plastic bowl, nothing special. Won't miss it. So, just going to shake it. It's been. Sitting in my bathroom for a while. Just going to put in a bowl like so. more watery than that but it's kinda huh, okay let's go oh I guess I'll just use you guys 
Oh crap. How low are you? Let me step back. Oh. I already changed my mind. When I did my hair red, I literally did like strand by strand. So, at least two. get real close is what I'm trying to get closer to the mirror okay so that I can get the lighter ends of my hair yeah totally time consuming but definitely more accurate if you do strand by strand I see a lot of people that use this semi-permanent and it just doesn't look good because they did it the way I started off doing the video, I mean doing this part, so. All I'm doing is just like that much on my finger. rubbing it in there was a point like I wanted to did I do this one already I think I did I wanted to dye my hair like black but I was like ah, I don't know I don't know like I think black looked more I don't know adult if that makes sense I'm like can't say it like because your hair is colored you're not an adult I don't know but kind of made me want to have like that grown woman change you know um but I settled to go well, more like a brown obviously I was gonna do purple but I'm like do I want like a color color like that again I don't think so. Otherwise, I'd be doing what I'm doing now, probably. Or do what I did before and just like strip the color out of my hair on purpose. So. This is, I'm totally losing track of which ones I've done now, obviously. Um. can't tell because my hair is wet so it looks dark yeah I think I did this one already Look how long this one is. A super long one. I'm going up a lot higher than I thought I, well, I planned. Hmm. We'll see how much I have it. I guess at the end, I'm gonna just hit up my roots anyway. Even though it's not really what I'm set out to do here. But that's what's happening, so I just keep going and going. Oh my gosh, guys, uh, my son just turned two, so, you know, I like a little taller now, terrible twos for sure, um, it's like a, so, I got a little, a little taller now, it's so cute, so this is what it's looking like.
just going to go like this. Don't really know what this is doing, but I'm going to do it anyway because I see people do it with their locks. Some say don't squeeze it in, but it's semi-permanent, so I'm just going to squeeze it in. You do you. You do you, boo. She wanna know me, I stay low-key, all gas, no brakes, baby, let them hoes sleep Body on 10, make your girl OD, I get in my way, never out of my lane Feel like you the one and I'm on one, so what it's gonna be? Baby squad up, we finna go deep, is you riding on a team, got what you need Baby, won't you keep me company? Promise you never lie to me Keep the moves on tuck I know it's all love Everything good Keep the vibes on crush I know it's all good Know it's all love decided to leave one out on this side so far um, I am running extremely low but pretty sure I mean I feel like it it did well it did good because oh yeah this is why I um, combine two Started like combining them now, just like at the root, and just let the ends do what they want to do, and then I'm just eventually like cut them off when they get longer. Um, I usually keep them together like with a little clip thingy, but I realized those like hair jewels like make the area wherever you have them at look super thin. So yeah, that didn't. The only reason why I'm combining my hair is because they were like pretty thin, weak locks, and so then here I am putting these jewels on them little clip thingies and they're making my hair even thinner so yeah y'all know y'all girl be very insecure about these damn edges um this is what I got <laughs> left I am literally going to wipe out what I can to get these couple front ones still cause I feel like she's just playing with me. So, here we are, and I am going to sit on the couch watch some YouTube I am going to sit 
put this in my head for about an hour. So, because I ain't going to be having no heat. It's just going to be like this. Smell that apple cider vinegar. Put the wet one on top. Um, there we go for my no excuses November no excuses just continue to just let that sit on the counter and do something with my hair um, I know I needed a wash and so not going along with my no excuses I did it finally um, this is what we got left people might like come up with their thumbnails because I don't know all right I'm going to clean up the very little mess that I have I did good and um make a cup of coffee and watch some YouTube bye y'all I'll be back um after I guess I'll check in after the hour and then of course I'll rinse it out show you guys what it looks like when it's wet and rinsed and then I may not even retwist it if I do of course I mean I have to reuse my hair when it's dry so I'll see y'all in those increments taking this off my head like pre pre rinse rinse hair dry boom all right bye y'all one hour later girl I see your face everywhere when I'm going out you'll be there this everything reminds me of you I can't take no more Girl, I think I'm losing my mind Try to go to work, but I lost track of time Cause everyone keep looking like you I can't take no more I miss your touch From your hands and your body It hurts so much To think of you as someone else Can't get enough When you're sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me What you need from me, need your love on me, put your love on me I'ma do everything for you, I don't want anyone but you Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me Can we stop the clock and rewind, go back to that moment in time When you say you want me for life, was it all a lie? Talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me What you need from me Need your love on me Put your love on me I'ma do everything for you I don't want anyone but you Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me
next day. Um, trying to fool you guys because I didn't fully retwist my hair. I did the front and I was like, I'm done. But I wanted to come back and actually like do a whole other view with my hair dry. Um, I remember like my last <clears throat> hair dyeing video. I left y'all hanging. Like I just threw in pictures and slides. I didn't really give my hair that much justice. So uh, my hair is dry now. It's the next day, obviously, like I said. So you can actually see like what color it is now when it's not wet. And then I'm going to retwist my hair, but it's not going to be in here because I don't feel like doing it right now. I might do it like random hours in the morning. I don't know. I just know it's not happening anytime soon. I do want to get this video edited and put up for most likely tomorrow. So uh, this is how my hair looks now. Um... <laughs> Take it away, feeling too good to me Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough Too caught up in your love I've been trying to forget But you won't let me Something in my brain wants you I've been hanging by myself Asking for help so it's like a real, you know, like a deep brown. Here's the ones that did not die. So I, I like it. Like, um, my hair has been light for years now. So, um, instead of going black, like I said before, I think this color definitely gives me what I wanted. It's just, you know, a bit of change. Still some color, um, just darker. So here we are. So I really hope the color goes like shows through after I'm like take this video. There, oh that looks good right there. Find that piece of went. So So that's how we're looking. Um, again, happy. And I'm just glad that I got that red out beforehand. Glad I got rid of the, the ashy-ish, dirty, blonde, brown, golden color I created. Um, so thank you guys for watching so much. This may or may not be my last dying video. I do know that um, if this just stays in a decent amount, I'll probably just keep throwing in semi-permanent. Um, I really don't want to do any more permanent, um, coloring to my hair. And, uh, <clears throat> yeah. Thank you for watching. Um, please subscribe, comment down below. Um, if you've used this same brand of hair dye or what's your next color you want. If you've never colored it before, what do you have in mind? And, um... Yeah, I really hope this is better than my first one. Even though my first one wasn't that bad at all. Hmm, I guess. Whatever. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.